Kwewa T. And I am Mr. C. And we're reporting why from the BBC, bringing you your daily broadcast from the pages of scriptures. Here's today's news. Now, we've been receiving reports coming in that there's a product that has been circulating around that is changing people's lives. This product has been around for centuries. After searching high and low in various dangerous places and other not so dangerous places, <laughs> we have discovered this product. Yes, and for your information, we have it here today! The love of God. According to the information about this product, nothing can separate you from the love of God. Once you have it, it sticks with you through the most challenging time. Wait a minute. What do you mean by nothing? Like nothing? nothing. Like nothing. Hey, what about sickness? Nope. Hunger? Nope. Rabies? Nope. Ice cream? Nope. Chocolate? Nope. What about a really, nope. really, really strong nothing, guy? Nothing, Mr. C, can separate you from the love of God. Today, we bring you a BBC investigative story. Mr. C and I will be weaving... Wait! What about Batman? No, Mr. C. Nothing. We will be weaving the studio to go out on the... Superman! No. Of a choir and interview ordinary men and women to see... Oh! Ah, I got it! Cupcakes! How about cupcakes? Have yes. experienced yes. the power of the yes. world yes. of God. Okay, fine. Come hey. I'll be your mom. Wait, you think that what do you think? Mr. C, I am coming with you. What? Why? No, you're not. You stay in the studio. You're in the studio. I am coming. No! Mr. C, I am coming with you to investigate. No, you're staying. I am coming. No, you're staying. I am coming. Staying. Coming. Staying. Coming. Staying. Coming. Staying. Coming. Staying. Coming. 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 Staying. Coming. 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 No, wait, wait, hey, I was tricked! No, wait, hey! You there! Now, do you have the love of God? What's that? Oh, the love of God is a special gift from God which allows us to do everything and keeps us close to Him. Is that true? Yes! I don't think so. Excuse me, so have you experienced the love of God? Oh, the love of God! Yes, of course! I am King David! I have been experiencing the love of God for so many years. If I, I have loved God and He has loved me since I was a little shepherd boy until the time that I killed Goliath and then I began to rule Israel and have worked with the Lord ever since. Tell me more about this Goliath. Oh, Goliath was this huge guy who thought he could defeat Israel because he was big and strong. But I relied on the love and power of God. But didn't you feel that God did not love you when Goliath was standing against you? Oh, no, no, no. I did not let what was in front of me influence how I felt because I focused on God and his love for me. And because of that, I was able to defeat him. Interesting. Well, excuse me, lady. Now, I have, can I ask you a question now? Have you heard about the love of God and do you have... Ah, oh, what a cute little coochie coochie the little grandson. He's a cute baby. He's not my grandson. He's my son. And yes, I know about the love of God. My name is Sarah and I waited for so long to have a baby. God kept telling me that he would give me and my husband a child. He even sent angels to tell us, but I was so disappointed. I thought God had forgotten about me. But God kept his promise. Nothing separated us from his love. And now I have my baby Isaac. Oh, that is so good. He's so cute. Well, come here, baby. It's good. Coochie, coochie, coochie. Excuse me, so... Yes. Have you experienced the love of God? Oh, funny you should mention that. Actually, I did not long ago. Tell me more about it. Well, you see, I had this skin condition where my skin would rot away. And, oh no, it's safe. You can come back now because I'm here. 
Yes, but this little girl from Israel told me about this God of Israel and said he could heal me. Well, well did he? Well, at first I didn't. I wasn't willing to listen because I had to do go back in some the, the lake in Israel or something. But I decided to listen and I took a bath in it and then my skin disease all went away. I guess this God is real and this love is powerful and real. And this concludes our investigative report on the love of God. We hope that you have experienced this love for yourself. And if you have not experienced this love, all you have to do is just ask for it. That's right, Mr. C. This has been our wrap-up on an amazing study of the miracles of God. We hope you expect miracles every day in your life. I'm Quirity. And I'm Mr. C. And we are reporting live from the, the BBC. BBC.